All right, guys, so back again detailing. I'm doing a daily driver, my parents' 2005 Honda Odyssey. So they took a trip up here about 1,200 miles, and as you can imagine, there is just a ton of bugs everywhere. So this is just going to be a video on me detailing their van, just a quick temporary detail is what I would call it. Um, really, the first step is to soak all the bugs. Really, the first thing I really did, which I actually didn't get in the video, was just with the spray. You can use water if you don't have access to a hose, or you can use detail spray. I would suggest even just starting with water. It keeps it a little bit cheaper just because you're not using your own products yet. So as you can see, I, I sprayed it down already, and I'm wiping. And really, the process is just spray, soak, wipe, and just keep doing that. It took me at least 15 minutes of just doing that even before I got to waxing it actually. So as you can see, I'm using a microfiber and I had sprayed it down and I'm wiping it and really just repeat the process until as many bugs are gone. It reduces the chance of you marring the paint, but with bugs, it's just so difficult. Um, having a, a, you know, a degreaser or some type of bug remover is ideal here. Of course, I didn't have one yet, so... Um, Really, all I'm doing is uh, with waterless wash, and then I'll, you know, I'll soak it in to the bugs, and then, you know, rinse and repeat. Next step, just dry it off before you apply the wax. Here, I'm using my most plush microfiber. Want to dry it down because wax and water don't really mix when you're applying it. So just get that dried up real quick. <laughs> Okay, back to it. This is Zymol Cleaner Wax. I actually had a really bad experience when I used this that day. It just started to get crusty and hard, and it didn't. It was horrible to remove. It didn't really have very good beading. It didn't have any good depth. It was just not a good wax. I had laying around from really when I first started cleaning the car, so I, I don't know where it is now. I, I might have thrown it away already, but it was just horrible. So... If you're ever looking for some sort of cleaner wax, I mean, this car is not detailed daily um, or detailed really at all ever uh, beyond anything that I do for them, you know, because I'm not around. So um, it's a black car. It needs clay barred. It needs some attention. But using this cleaner wax was definitely not the best choice here. Um, as you can see in this clip, I actually changed back to the col colonite. 845 so I don't know why I decided to use this just because it was a product that I normally don't use and I wasn't going to be using it on my car so I just figured I would try it out and it would be more than fine on their car and for their use but it just didn't look good I wasn't happy with it at all so just as some point of reference colonite 845 is definitely the way to go us no matter what car whether it's a car that's you know kind of beat up and not really taken care of or even if it's a new car that's not really detailed or perfected yet so no matter what colonite 845 is definitely in my opinion the best choice uh, really for any car no matter what your situation is okay the really last step here all i'm doing is buffing the colonite off it sat on here maybe five minutes or so all the bugs are pretty much off, at least as best as I could. Like I said, this is just a temporary situation. Um, they're not going to have this car detailed, and I'm not going to do anything more to it, at least in the short run. So I just want to get the bugs off for them and seal up the front for their trip back. You know, they're going to have another, you know, 1,200 miles back down to Florida. So might as well at least try to seal it, keep the bugs from embedding too much into the paint. And that's really it, guys. So I hope you enjoyed this. Hopefully this was helpful to you. I know I didn't get a lot of glamour shots or anything like that like I like to. Um, I just set up the GoPro and kind of went to town here. And, you know, I'm checking out the surface. And really, I, I was definitely more happy with it. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope this was informative, especially to those daily drivers out there. Um, quick thing to do to the front. You know, the depth is not going to look the same if you're sealing the front and no other part. Really not ideal. Um, but it's it does the job and um, it gets things done in the very very short term so i hope you enjoyed this video and i'll see you next time thanks